the surprising twist, Red Fury of Team Trakers has passed Eric Schultz of Team Black Ghost to take the lead. I got this race in the bag. Keep telling yourself that, Schultz. You're the greatest! I wasn't gonna tell you, but I'm positive. It's totally true. How did you find out? I overheard them. He was on the phone. They were so intimate when they spoke. Eric Schultz has a secret girlfriend. But who is she? Hmm. Schultz is right behind Fury. There's high drama here today, racing fans. The driver who crosses the finish line first will win the Super Trophy of Africa! Eric Schultz is gaining on Red Fury! It looks like Eric Schultz is practically glued to Red Fury's rear bumper! Red, he's going to launch an attack! It's the last lap! Just maintain your lead, Red. Another first place finish. How do you keep doing it? We're the Drakers. A driver is only as good as his crew. And we have the best. Spoken like a real champ. Are you looking forward to the victory kiss you'll be getting today? Huh? Surely you knew about the winner getting a kiss. Photojournalist and Miss Super Trophy Nina Starr will kiss the lucky winner. <laughs> Hey guys, who wouldn't want to be in Red Fury's shoes right now? It looks like this will be the first of many kisses for Red Fury and Nina Starr. That was a thrilling race, and it's only the beginning, because tonight we've got that special Drakers party. You going? Hector's calling it the Night of Red Lights, and he's been planning it for weeks now. Should be great. By any chance, do you have plans tonight? No, no plans yet. We could go together, right? I'd love to, Red. <laughs> See you around, Red. See you, Nina. Yeah, goodbye. Miss Super Trophy? You'll have to excuse me, Nina. I never knew you were in a beauty pageant. It wasn't exactly a beauty pageant, okay? Hmm? They always award Mr. or Miss Super Trophy to the person who attends the most races. Well, congratulations, Nina. Gee, thank you. <laughs> I'm sorry if I embarrassed you. Well, in fact, it could have been worse. Hmm? Margot Duvall might have won. And I assure you, I would have enjoyed that winning kiss a lot less. <laughs> Very charming, Fury. But don't think you've won Nina's heart just yet. There's no room on the guest list. I'll see what I can do. But I can't make any promises. People are still trying to get in, huh? Don't get me started. Might I ask what this big surprise is all about? If I told you, it wouldn't be a surprise. But I did bring that item you wanted. So, I take it this is the bracelet you found in the Rivera's room after they disappeared. Yes, but what does it mean? I'm sure I don't know, but I have a friend in New York who's an expert on symbols and markings. If you don't mind, I'd like to have him look at it. I'm not pleased about this. The Draker's party is all anyone's talking about. And that positive press? It's rather unfortunate. 
That's why I want you to make sure that party is not a success, Margot. I'll try, but if I'm too heavy-handed, people will get suspicious. Do not disappoint me, Miss Duval. I don't like to be disappointed. I said I'll do my best, but don't expect miracles, Mr. Goton. Then I suggest you start praying, Miss Duval. Hmm. <laughs> the long-awaited moment has arrived. The stadium is decked out in red tonight for the official launch of two new automobile models that Team Drakers have been working on in secret for months now. In just a few minutes, two of Drakers' top engineers will address the crowd. And here come the members of Team Drakers now. Alan and Max, what can you tell us about these new cars? Everyone's curiosity will be satisfied really soon. All we can say is that the surprise will be truly worth the wait. And here's Red Fury of the Drakers Seniors Division with the lovely Miss Super Trophy herself, Nina Starr. Hey, isn't that Chris and Fabry over there? Ah, Mr. Gotan, it's a pleasure to see you. Good evening, Hector. I'm really curious to see what this surprise of yours is all about. Qualifying driver in the third round of the Super Trophy of Africa. Let's go down to the main convention room where the voting is currently underway. Jim? All right, racing fans, which of our kids division drivers will you, the audience, vote back into the Super Trophy of Africa? As always, you at home will decide. Ed Mitchell or Stan Murphy? Lolly or Kabir Suri? Aim your remote control at your favorite driver on the screen and click enter. We've tallied the full results and the winner is Ed Mitchell. Thanks for participating. I can't believe Ed won. That's too bad for Lolly and Kabir. Amazing, every single vote was for Ed Mitchell. Huh? We've never seen anything like this. The vote was unanimous. Something tells me this new guy can't be trusted. Don't give it another thought, Clip. We'll watch him like two hawks. Perhaps Ed Mitchell would like to say a few words to express his gratitude. I think the public wants to see a tough race. And that's just what I'll give him. What a show off. With the winner decided here, let's go back up to the Drakers party. This crowd is ecstatic. Welcome the two new Drakers automotive models we've heard so much about. No doubt about it, the Drakers certainly know how to make quite an entrance. gonna be a night to remember, folks. Let's see what these babies can do. Sandra and Hector? That is Sandra and Hector. What are they doing? Wow. No wonder they've been so secretive. No one is more experienced than Sandra Logan and Hector Vega. They've been practicing with top stunt professionals and the results are amazing! The Drakers sure know how to put on a stunt show. What happened to Margaret? Did she go into hiding? Knowing her, she'll find some negative angle to exploit in all this. I don't have much time. I have to prepare my report for tonight's broadcast. Gotan is expecting me to come up with an expose about the Drakers before the stunt show ends. Hey, I know that, sweetheart. Ah. Mm. Mm. 
I just hate to see you so stressed out all the time. I wish you'd just kick back and enjoy yourself. I have to bow to Goton's wishes, and it makes me regret taking up journalism. Hey, come on, you're doing this for us, right? You know, I've been noticing you spend a lot of time with that silly blonde. Are you seeing me now? What are you talking about? That's a professional relationship. Uh, uh, huh? I trust you remember we're supposed to keep our romance a secret until this Draker's business is finished. That's making a big assumption there's any romance at all after what I've seen. You better watch your step, Eric, or I'll be gone. Huh? I gotta go to work. See you later. After months of negative press, the Drakers are definitely back on top. Last night, we learned that Team Drakers really knows how to throw a party. Unfortunately, parties aren't like races, and now it's up to Team Drakers to prove they can be just as successful where it matters, like on the racetrack. No special effects and fireworks for these Hollywood hotshots. She's no, always sir. so calm. Huh. And always in our corner. Let's just hope all that partying didn't go to Bravo and Morelli's head. Well, so much for fair and balanced. Hector's right. We've got to block out all these distractions. Hmm. hmm. Let's win round point in the Super Trophy of Africa. The woman is right. Now let's get back to work. Which of these drivers will achieve X Racer? The last race in the Super Trophy of Africa is about to begin. Tony Parker of Team Black Ghost is in the pole position to start this race, followed by Chris Bravo of Team Drakers. It's no secret that Bravo and Parker have become bitter enemies. Activate X Racer! <laughs> we are the Drakers! Contact and ready to turn ignition! Ha! Ha! Hello, Chris. Hello, Fabri. Contact and setup is complete. Chris, Fabri, the pace car is good to go. Two laps behind the pace car will help launch our drivers into top speed. Track three of Circuit Desert Rose is 4.5 kilometers long, and its unique design will prove a challenge to the driver. And they're off! Listen to those mighty titans roar! Let's start, Zach. Let's try to keep that up for the whole race, okay? Watch out! Zach wants to pass you! Are you ready for format, Bob? I'm ready! All right, then do it! Spectacular! Morelli passes Zach and moves into third. The Drakers are now behind Black Ghost. That was excellent work, boys. Zach won't try that again. Now let's concentrate on Tony. Tony, listen up. The two Drakers are on to something. Don't worry, boss. I can handle those two pipsqueaks. For the moment, Parker's in the lead. Bravo and Morelli are behind him, followed by Zach and Ed Mitchell. That new driver for Team Hurricane wants revenge for what Chris and Fabri pulled earlier. He's gaining on Fabri Morelli. I guess the party's over. Looks like Team Draker is finished. All right, Zach. It's time for you to gamble away an X-Card Rush. X-Card Rush, rocket engine. Wow, did you see that? With that move, Zach's taking the lead. Not for long. This next trick always works in practice. Let's see if it works during a race. Move aside, Zach, or whatever your name is. I took that turn way too fast. Warning, stability compromise, reduce speed. <laughs> Looks like Tony Parker of Team Black Ghost is going into a spin, and he's taking Chris Bravo with him. No! Just my luck. I can bounce back from this. This race is over for Chris Bravo, and apparently for Tony Parker. Bravo is out of this competition, while Tony Parker is still in the race, albeit in last place. But wait! Parker is pulling out onto the track! Mm. The Moran is total. Gearbox, suspension, the works. Gentlemen, we do have our work cut out for us. Oh, I blame that Tony Parker. 
He took that turn much too fast, and unfortunately, Chris was in his way. Fabri is still in the race, so let's not give up hope yet, okay? Now let's concentrate on Tony. Fabri's no Chris Bravo. I mean, the kid's great, but... There's still a chance. Zach has a slight lead over Fabri. Fabri, Zach has only six seconds on you. Hold that position. Chris, the pace car will soon be out to help you. Okay, this time Parker has really gone too far. I'm sorry, Chris. Don't worry about me. Fabri, just concentrate on winning. Hello, Hector. The officials are already making inquiries about what happened to you yeah, out there. Yeah, but in the meantime, I'm out of the race. Ah, oh, we need to take advantage of this gift. Goton's gonna be happy this time. Mm -hmm. Bravo's out, but Parker is still in last place. I trust you have some ideas in mind. I don't think we need to intervene, cause we have Ed Mitchell on our team. I love that boy's spirit. I made an excellent decision in bringing him to our team. We have an amber light. Huh? The cars are slowing down. The drivers have to maintain their positions while Bravo is removed from the track. I guess all that partying took its toll. Had Bravo been a more experienced driver, he likely never would have been in this mess. This is the perfect time to make repairs or replace tires ahead of schedule. We see the Drakers pit crew led by John Morelli, Fabri's uncle. Black <laughs> Ghost and Hurricane pit crews are also hard at work. There's the green light. Now let's get back to the Super Trophy of Africa. Our drivers only have to take a few more laps and then we'll find out who will win in Formula Kids. Are you ready, Corvus? Never been as ready before, sir. Fabri, you can counter Ed with an X card defense. I've got it. X card defense, snorkel plus. Here we go. With that X card, Morelli activates a special exhaust pipe that obscures Ed Mitchell's field of view. Looks like Team Black Ghost is in trouble again. Of course, thanks to their friends, the Drakers. You think that's enough to stop me? X-Card Power, Black Ghost Turbo One! Ed Mitchell springs into action. Using an X-Card, he quickly takes second place. Will Morelli be able to counteract that brilliant maneuver? Well, it's the last lap and Ed Mitchell hits the throttle. It's too much for Morelli of Team Drakers. In the exciting battle for second place, it looks like Ed Mitchell gets the better of Fabri Morelli. So the mysterious act of Team Hurricane has his work cut out for him. That's it, Mitchell. Crush the competition. What did I tell you? I love that boy's spirit. He's a winner. Zach, don't try to overtake him from the right. Or at the entrance to the curb, or you'll be pulled into his car. Remember, Zach, what happened to Chris Bravo out there shouldn't happen to you. You've got this, Zach. All you need to do is just cruise to the finish line. I've got to win this race! I've got to win this race! I've got to win! Yeah. 
Ed Mitchell is pushing his car to the limit while Team Hurricane struggles to maintain its lead. Scorpio crosses the finish line, followed by Ed Mitchell of Team Black Ghost, Pirelli of Drakers in third, and Tony Parker in fourth. Team Hurricane wins the Super Trophy of Africa in Formula Kids. This team has come a long way since this competition started, and now the fans of this dark horse are making some noise. Drakers and Team Black Ghost have to contend with this upstart American team and its mysterious new driver. Team Hurricane taking the title. Imagine that. Very good, Ed. We're very happy with your performance lately, Ed, and especially the way you compete with those at the top. You made an excellent showing today, my friend. Thanks. I'll do anything to improve my skills, coach. I want to become the best driver ever in the history of Team Black Ghost. Give it a rest, Mitchell. The top driver ever is standing right in front of you. Tony's the best, punk. I like to see a healthy rivalry between drivers. I'm sure it will be good for Team Black Ghost. <laughs> 